say hi to the bad guy. When you think giant purple monster, this horrible image may appear in your mind. Wrong image, mind. This is the giant purple monster you should fear, Jason Voorhees. He is here to kill your friends. Oh, and you too. Jason resides in Camp Crystal Lake. Jason is an expert in the field of child kill. He murders the young because he takes advantage of the weak and weaponless. The strong and weaponful? Well, that's a different story. Face life. Jason enjoys terrorizing camp counselors that enjoy regular day camp activities like throwing rocks at camp zombies. Jason has a family ally who assists in his craving for youthful slaughter. The decapitated Pamela Voorhees. She protects his treasured sweater by biting her enemies. Pamela will keep Jason's sweater safe and always protect him. Well, not on the campgrounds, but deep in a cave using aromatherapy. Jason wears a mask to hide his ugly. Jason has four strands of hair that he refuses to shave. He believes he can grow it back. Jason is wrong. Jason wears a purple workman's outfit with a sickly green mask and matching sickly green shoes. Jason has purple eyes. He is out to torture the pale, emotionless, and purple-head children of Crystal Lake. Jason commands his victims to stand in the corner. Await your punishment. The camp counselors feel a sense of confidence fighting only zombies, but at night, that is when they must face Jason. He will box them. Jason is an accomplished pugilist. However, Jason only uses his right hand. He does not believe in South Paul rules. Jason has incredible evading techniques. Jason is okay knowing that he may lose the battle, but he is intent on winning the war. Just kidding. Jason is an incredibly sore loser. Jason will sucker punch, or in this case, sucker X, his victor, and then he runs. It is inherently known that even if Jason is beaten, he is never beaten. He will come back stronger, craftier, and jason -ier with better right punches. Jason's fatal flaw is that he does not realize that his pattern is easily predicted. Also, he forgot his knife. Jason attacks in the water like a shark with the face of Jason. Face knife. Face, face knife. knife. Jason is too carefree with his actions. He does not realize his activities are easily visible on Camp Radar. Camp Radar even has the ability to predict the time a child's life will expire by Jason's evil hands. When Jason is finally beaten, he does not raise again with a boost of confidence. Instead, he sits sadly and reflects upon his poor mission strategy, his stolen sweater, and his inability to use his left hand. That is because Jason Voorhees does not punch to the left. A question of a month of terrible characters. Next episode. I'd like one Jill sandwich, please. Hold the lettuce. Scratch that. In fact, add more lettuce. Quest with me. Learn with us. Enrich your mind. Empower your anchor like our material. Subscribe to our page. Put character into question. Return every Monday for more. A question of character.